welcome to another weekly vlog today is sunday april 24th um it's 11 32 and your girl just made herself some coffee as you just seen i've been making this like with my nespresso for i would say probably about two to three weeks now and baby i don't need starbucks this right here hits i made this for my dad probably like a week or two ago and he was like girl this tastes exactly like Starbucks. He said, he said, you could have gave me this coffee in the dark and I wouldn't have known. I would have thought it was Starbucks. And I'm like, okay, your girl is saving coins because I used to spend a lot of money on Starbucks like every morning or like every week because I wouldn't drink coffee like every morning. I would try to like, you know, but this, this right here, good. Mm. I'm sitting in my room because I kind of just wanted to talk to you guys just a little bit before we get started with the vlog. This is definitely a weekly vlog um, as you just seen which I'm about to do now. I know it sounds like a little bit weird but I'm about to. It's Sunday. I'm going to like do kind of like a Sunday reset. Get my place together, clean, tidy up, you know, wash dishes, things like that. Um, but I just put it in the beginning of this vlog um, because it's just like a mini Sunday reset. And um, if you guys want me to do like a full on Sunday reset I definitely will do that for you but I kind of want to talk to you guys like it's been a very long time since I did a vlog probably since my birthday which was like back in March and we're going into the month of May <laughs> we're about to be in the month of May but I definitely wanted to talk to you guys and just kind of like you know tell you guys a little bit of an update like you know what's been going on with your girl and you know what she's been doing or whatever so um okay so where have i been i know some people have been asking me like girl what you've you been doing like on youtube or whatever so i honestly feel like this year for me please let me know in the comments if you feel the same way but this year has kind of started off a little bit rocky for me like i just don't feel like i'm accomplishing the goals that i want to accomplish or i set for myself this year when i'm like my vision board so it just has got me down you know just a little bit because i'm just like okay like what's going on like what's happening the first quarter was super duper slow like super slow for me minimum like sponsorships um which is super duper crazy um especially now that we're like back outside as people like to call it um i would think that brands will be picking up when it comes to like collaborations and things like that or whatever but they haven't. A few things did happen for me, which I am very excited about. I do have some things that's in the works. And then on top of that, I couldn't put out a lot of videos like I really, really wanted to because I was like moving. And honestly, you guys, like this move for some reason to me has been super duper hectic. I don't know why. Um, I finally got some things in place, but there's some things that I really, really need to like get together. And I feel like once I get those in the places that they need to be or I just get rid of them, then like... I will feel much better. I will feel a little bit more in order, if that makes sense. So I just kind of feel a little out of order because of like the move and um, just honestly, the lack of motivation of wanting to like unpack and, you know, get things like together and stuff like that. So I just feel like the move just has really made my gear a little off to like a weird start. So that was that. Like, yeah, of course, like, you know that you're moving, you're prepping for your move and things like that. But I think it's like me not wanting to unpack is what really like gets me. And it's just like, a, I moved in February and we're almost going into May. And I still feel like my apartment is not like in order, if that makes sense. But yeah, so that's like one of the things. Things have been like super duper slow and I just really haven't had the motivation to like really create content or anything like that. So that's another thing. I had to turn the brightness down because I felt like it was a little bit too bright. But anyway, so yeah, that's that. Like I think last week or the week before last, my parents came up here. They were supposed to go to the auto show, like the auto fair show. Um, and you guys know, I tell you, I go every year with my dad, but we didn't get in this year because um, we didn't secure a scooter um, because they are not able to walk that whole, uh, I don't know what it's called, but you like, if you ever been, it's like a race car track, um, but it's so big. So they were not able to like, uh, 
they were not able to like walk that so we needed to secure a scooter honestly a golf cart because my mom didn't know how to drive the scooter but we wasn't able to secure it so we was we didn't go but anyway so a little bit after that got something to eat and then we came back got Zane and we went to like a pond and you know just kind of like chilled out I don't know if it was something at the pond or if it was something that I ate because we did try a new restaurant. It was a seafood restaurant and I eat seafood all the time. It's actually like one of my favorite foods. Um, but yeah, like, um, so I just had a shrimp basket. That was like a Friday and I had to come back and get ready for one of my sister's birthday dinner that was happening later on that night. So literally once um, they left, I started getting ready. I think I got in the shower and I was doing like my makeup and stuff and then like my face started well before yeah before i um started uh doing my makeup my face started feeling like really itchy why is it feeling itchy let me let me let me let me say this before i wasn't already feeling good that day anyway because i ate chick-fil-a the night before and i don't know but something was wrong with that chick-fil-a because it literally had my stomach like me feeling nauseous and then it just didn't sit well with me it just didn't so I wasn't feeling good like I like when I was trying to sleep that whole night I just didn't feel good and then the next day I still did not feel good or whatever. I was uneasy <laughs> the whole day or whatever and then I started feeling itchy like my my face. Sucked it up, got ready, um did my makeup, attended the dinner. At the dinner like I was literally like feeling sick and super duper itchy and I was like I don't know what's going on or whatever. Ate my food. And then right after um, dinner, we was going to this event. So I was like, let me stop by the store and get some Benadryl. So that's what I did. I got some Benadryl, took the Benadryl. And um, I stayed, I think I stayed probably maybe an hour and 30 minutes or something. I don't really remember. And then I left. The next day I woke up, boom, full blown allergic reaction like all over my face you can see like little bumps i was super duper itchy i was super duper irritated like everything i was so annoyed and just so irritated and um that whole day i literally just like slept because i was just on benadryl the whole day i had benadryl cream and everything i was just so so irritated on top of that my scalp was so so irritate like i had scratched my scalp so much where i'm not gonna say it was like raw but it was very 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 sensitive so like even if i was trying to put some like products in it to kind of relieve itchy scalp um it would burn because like it was so sensitive because of like the scratching <sighs> So I was like, what is going on? And that lasted for like a week. So that was the reason why I did not record that week. And I was so irritated. I couldn't even put on makeup. Even when I felt a little bit better after like three days, I tried to put some, like do my normal skincare routine and it flared back up because I was still so sensitive. And then my scalp was so itchy. Like girl, I cannot even express to you how itchy my scalp was and irritated my scalp was it was so crazy i was like so i was like i don't understand what's going on i was like is it pollen in my head like or, like i didn't understand i really didn't so anyway that was that whole week so i didn't record once i started feeling better once i started feeling better i was like okay i'm gonna record the next week we're gonna be on our game girl like we're going into the second quarter like get yourself together okay we gotta come hard for the second quarter girl cycle came on and if you've been following me for a while you know that i have bad cycles like mm -mm. the first two to three days like i'm very very fatigued bloated but also like extremely nauseous like feeling very weak as well so so i just was like i was down i couldn't do anything <laughs> which that was this week <laughs> I'm talking about the next week, but that was this week. Like I'm down, I can't really do anything. And like, as my cycle is like going off, I feel better obviously. So here we are, I'm recording. <laughs> anyway, so I'm really trying to make sure that um, I just get everything that I want to say out or whatever. So I do apologize that this portion is very long. Um, anyway, I don't know why I'm out of breath. Just kind of wanted to sit down and talk to you guys and let you know that so this is the last week in april uh today we're just doing like i said a mini sunday reset routine which you guys have already seen i think a little bit later on when i may go to trader joe's to get some fresh flowers and i may pick up a few packages um just to have like for the week and i think i may go to a few home stores like i'm going to target because there's this rug that i want for my office and i may go to 
maybe home goods or something because i am trying to look for some black pillows because i'm trying to change out like trying to change the vibe of my living room so tomorrow we are doing work so today is more so prepping for the week um i'm not exactly sure what i'm recording tomorrow i think i have it planned though but yeah tomorrow we're doing work tuesday i have an eyebrow appointment i have a meeting on wednesday and then the rest of the week i'm not i don't think i'm doing anything for the rest of the week but just editing and doing work or whatever in this vlog i'm going to give you like a little bit of an apartment update which is going to include my office area so you guys are going to see like my vision for that and i have furniture that's coming in may that i ordered in february <laughs> so finally it's coming it says that it's going to be late may but i don't know because it's like i i received an email probably like a week or so ago talking about we have an update on your order and it's like we're sorry there's a delay with your package it's gonna be in like july and i'm like girl i started to call them and give them peace of my mind but i was like you know what i'm just gonna hold off because i really just don't have time now it's saying i don't see it say late july it's saying may but hopefully fingers crossed that i get my office furniture in may i hope i i truly hope because um i'm tired of looking at those boxes you guys are going to see what i'm talking about in just a few but i'm tired of looking at those boxes but this week like um it's just honestly this week is just dedicated to creating content and um getting like back on a schedule unpacking my office more and getting rid of things kind of doing like a spring like cleaning you know type thing or whatever so yeah that's that and yeah i did get a package from cb2 so i'm going to show you that really quick because i just got it i actually need a box cutter like i should not be using scissors oh this is so cute okay so <laughs> this is a uh trash can it's small though it's super duper small this is definitely small so this is a little waste can for my uh for my bathroom my main bathroom it's a matte black waste can that is so small like like i don't even know if i like it let the people see you because they ain't seen you in a while let the people see you zany oh <laughs> i hate when zany doing that look at the people zany look look Say hey. They ain't a man now, okay? That's on um, period. He's no longer a puppy. That's so crazy, you guys. You have seen Zane transition from a puppy to a big, big boy. I don't know why Zane be looking like that. Like, he never likes to look at the camera. He hates taking pictures. And then, look. Like, why his lip look like that? He's a sweet man. Oh, he's a sweet man. <laughs> I don't know i'm trying to figure out if i'm gonna take this back or not this is mini like wait thing he trying to smell oh this look that look this is so mini maybe i should have just did the uh measurements i was so happy to get this I'm just trying to figure out if it's worth it or not. Cause like, what? Like, <laughs> why is it so many? Like, but this is how it looks. Like, is this worth it? Like, it is so many. Like, I don't know. Is this normal? I feel like I just have bigger trash cans or whatever. So I don't know. Yeah, so I'm about to go ahead and start cleaning. And once I get ready, then we may just head out to, um, like I said, Trader Joe's and Target and maybe Home Goods today. So, yeah. Hey, y'all. So I made it back to the house. I didn't vlog when I was in Target. So that's disappointing. But your girl was kind of overwhelmed. I didn't feel like doing it. It's 10.38 right now. So I'm actually about to go to bed because I'm trying to get up a little bit early tomorrow so I can do some work and get back started. I bought some flowers. I'll probably show you that in the morning. I got some zip ties to put like my outside lights on the balcony. I was about to do that, but the zip ties are actually too short. But <clears throat> whatever. I think, let me see. 
Let me give you a quick, like a really quick haul of what I got. I really didn't get much. So started off, I got this big ass basket. <laughs> I probably really didn't need it. I don't think it's gonna stay right there, but it goes in the room and it just holds like Zane's blanket and stuff like that. I'm probably gonna put some other blankets in here as well. But for right now, it's there. I have the tag still on. This is from Bright Room in case you're wondering. Um, and I just love the little handles here. It kind of goes perfect like with my theme, black and like that neutral cream beige, you know, type color. So that's why I got it. But I love the handles on here. I think the basket was like 20 something dollars. It will be linked below. And this is like Zane's little um, water bowl area. I don't like it right there, but it's convenient for now. Maybe I might get something else um, to go right there. But anyway, I got it because um, in the night, sometimes he likes to get up and drink water. So he doesn't have to go all the way into the kitchen. And um, I be having my door shut, so <laughs> that's why I have it right there. But either way it goes, like, I don't know. I'm thinking about getting some like something there for that area. I don't know just yet. Yeah, I got that basket from Target and I just re-upped on some Swiffer Jet, Wet Jet wipes or whatever they, those Wet Jet wipes, uh, mopping pads. I got this little oil, you know, glass oil bottle here because I really needed one. So, y'all, I literally, so this broken store, I had one and I got to the uh, self checkout and it fell over and literally broke. And I was like, I hope they don't charge me because <laughs> that's gonna piss me off. But um, no, they didn't, but yeah. So I just got this one and I don't know, this is probably like $8. I got some Perfect, I got some uh, women vitamins. I've had these before, so I'm about to start back on these because I need to get back on my stuff. I got the wet jet um solution i got these little um vase filler like balls so this is what i got these little god dang y'all i can't get it together <laughs> i got these vase filler i don't know what you would call these but yeah vase filler kind of like little decorative like balls here and i'm gonna show you where i put them at i had one i already have some but i needed to get another one I got some jewelry from Target. The, the jewelry be super duper expensive. But I got two bracelets here. I think that these are so freaking cute. Oh, I love these. So these were $12.99 a piece. They're gonna be so cute on the arm. And again, everything will be linked down below. And then I got these bangles. Well, they're bracelets, but like little bangles here. Gold, you, got, you girls know I am a gold girl. It's not focusing, but you get the gist. And then I got two earrings. So I got these here, cause my other ones from Target that are my favorite ones, they broke. And I could have got them again today, but I was like, no, nah, I'm not gonna do that. Um, because they like, I, that would be my third time purchasing them. So I got these here. Can they focus? So I got these right here. I like the little shape of these. And then the last ones I got were these. It has like a little two-tone, so it has silver and gold. I think these are so cute. This is like the um, media stand. Um, it's not completed. I think I'm going to spray paint those little things black and that black. And then I got to add some more like stuff to it. <clears throat> but I got like these little vase fillers here. And I already had those. And I just bought these just to kind of give it a little bit more, you know, a little bit more like... Girl, you can't even see it. <laughs> yeah, so I'm just gonna put some more on it just so it can just be, you know, filled. I honestly probably could have gotten like two more because I like for, because I kind of want it to like overlap like that. You know what I mean? Like, isn't that cute? I think like that's cute. So. Hey Zany. Hey. Hey Zany. Yeah. Hey boy. Hey man. Hey boy. Hey Zany. I think that this is doing something. I think that's cute. So we'll see. 
but um, that's what how it looks so far. Maybe I don't need another one. Maybe that just completes it. You know what I'm saying? Like, I think that's cute. I probably don't need another one. And like I said, Zane's toys, girl, it don't matter like what I clean up. His toys <laughs> will be out and about. He grabs his toys and I really like that. I love the fact that he just grabs his toys out of the um, basket, like he's getting it together. But I'm just giving you guys a little bit of an update, you know, on the place or whatever. So yeah, that's like, this is the theme as you can see. Um, I would personally like another media stand, but I'm not doing that. I'm just gonna keep what I got and make some stuff work um, as much as I can. So yeah so that's how i got it um i don't like the media stand but we're gonna make it work <laughs> um because i refuse to just continue to keep buying furniture and furniture and furniture um, like i said i'm planning on spray painting those two things black and then that black and then obviously adding something else maybe neutral cream or black you know to this but this is still like a work in progress i'm getting rid of that tree right there or i'm gonna like transfer it to my bedroom i'm not sure just yet but i know for a fact that this right here like the tree is just too heavy and I don't like how heavy it is. Um, I want something, uh, as far as like with the leaves, it's just too much. I want something that is a little bit um, more clean and minimalistic. So I'm thinking about getting a uh, olive tree because it's not as like heavy as this. But yeah, that's how that looks. And then as you can see, this is kind of like how my table is. Um, the black cream, whatever. Um, I just actually did this today. So I kind of switched this up and then I need to get like a little rug, but that's what we have going on so far. Nothing really, nothing really too serious. But anyway, you guys, I'm about to go to bed. So I'm going to talk to you tomorrow. Good morning, you guys. So today is Monday, April 25th. It is 10 o'clock. I'm about to kind of get my day started. Um, Zane has been walked. I just made up my bed. I'm about to um, light a candle. Um, see what I can find to eat because your girl is hungry. I don't think I have anything in the refrigerator. <sighs> so I have some yogurt. I have yogurt. Y'all, this alkaline water, it's a Harris Cedar brand. Oh my God. It is so good. I have to get some more. I know you're not supposed to drink like cold water like right when you wake up in the morning but I don't know that's it's something about cold water for me that just really hits I don't know but this like anyway this alkaline water like girl it is so freaking good oh my gosh and I heard alkaline water is like really good for you so yeah okay so I have these crescent rolls I do have eggs but this bacon, I'm not really too sure about this bacon. I'm about to see what I can find like to eat. My scalp is irritating me again. I told you guys at the beginning of the vlog, like it was irritating me when I had that allergic reaction and now it's irritating me again. Um, and I was doing so good. Like I washed it. Yeah, I washed it. Soon as I washed it, it felt so good. Like it felt amazing. I got some scalp and hair oil um, and a few other things or whatever, just to kind of like make sure that it's not like dry, girl. I don't know, but it was definitely, um, I, I still feel it. I don't know. What about this last night? I think I told you guys, this little oil dispenser. So I'm about to put the, um, oil in here and this is how it looks i don't know it looks weird right there but i was gonna purchase one from like cb2 um it was like a little kind of like unique one but it wasn't like my favorite one and girl like it was like 30 something dollars and i'm like cb2 don't i'll say mine like i think i paid that's from target i think i paid like eight dollars so if you know me, I'm about to make my coffee. I'll probably just do yogurt. All right, I have to go grocery shopping. But I hate going to the grocery store. So I may get one of those people to do it. If you have an espresso, I use this. This is the kind. I actually have some more I need to like 
fill up. I actually tried a few of these. I just don't like them. I like this one as well. So I use that and then the little shot glass that I got from Amazon. Um, I have these little coffee syrups. You guys seen this in one of my moving vlogs. I got these, uh, what is these called? These jars. I got these jars from the Polish Jar store. I'll leave a link if you guys are interested. I don't know, I put about like three, four pumps. Maybe that was four or five. <laughs> and then I got the labels here from Etsy. So first thing I do, and I got these like disposable cup straws lids from Amazon. Again, I will link all that below. But lately, I couldn't find that. So I got this one, which is the Smuckers. It's a Sunday syrup. This been hitting, girl. So, but I don't like the way that, you know, it dispenses. So like, soon as I pull it, like it's so thick, you see? But I just like to like line everything. I'm gonna put ice in here, milk in here. I do 2% and then um, I'm gonna show you the creamer and stuff I use. This is how much milk I put in. Like I said, I just kind of like eyeball it. Just do two of these. So once it finish, I press the button again and do another one. Um, again, this is the creamer that I use. I just take a little glass. Pour it in. That's probably about good. And then I take my handheld milk frother and then I'm going to froth it. I do have this, I forgot what they call it. I do have this, but I don't be wanting to clean this. Like, I truly don't. This is so much easier. So yeah. So we're gonna start this. And don't think that this is too much like milk and creamer. Like these shots are very, very strong. That one at least. This is definitely very much like bold. You see? And then I just put this over it. And then bam, that's it. Okay. Put that back and I just need to wipe this in. And then I wanted to show you the flowers that I got yesterday from Target, like absolutely gorgeous. These are so beautiful, I could not pass it up. Hey y'all, I don't know if you can see me or not, probably not. So hello, hello everybody. Can we go, can we go? Okay. Hello everyone, um, happy Tuesday. I think today is the, is the 26th. I'm headed to, you probably can't see me. Ugh, I'm late and I don't like to be late because of these darn lights, so annoying. So, um, I don't know if you can see me or not. Let me just pull up my shades really quick so you guys can see me, but um, happy Tuesday. Today is April 26th. I'm headed to um, get my eyebrows done. Um, I'm not gonna record the process because I've done this before, but um, I think I'm gonna do like a maintenance vlog, you know, sometime soon. I don't know because your girl has literally not been doing what she's supposed to be doing. Like just keeping herself together. Um, I think I told you guys like in one of my videos that I recorded yesterday, but um, I think that'll be out or it may not be out before this vlog, but I haven't been um, getting my nails done. Oh my God, look at this 18 wheeler. I haven't been getting my nails done because um, I just been like giving them a little bit of a break. Um, wait a minute, where am I supposed to be going? It's not telling me to go this way. I'm glad I was paying attention. Um, but I haven't been getting my nails done because like I've been just giving them a little bit of a break. Um, I've noticed that my nail has been like my nails have been even my toenails because I used to get acrylics. Um, I used to get acrylic on my toes, but I've noticed that they've been a little bit brittle um, and just not as healthy as I would like them. So I just been trying to give them a little bit of a break. So that's what I've been doing. And my battery is going dead, which is crazy. But yeah, also you guys know I've been getting laser. I was doing laser hair removal um, on my chin, neck, and also, you know, down there. And um, girl, I haven't been since December. Like, whoa, okay. Ugh. 
excuse me. All right, you guys. So I'm back, but you cannot. Oh my gosh, both of my batteries are going dead or like what? what's just happening? Anyway, you guys, I'm back. My eyebrows are done. Once I get home, oh my gosh. Once I get home and charge my battery, I'll show you guys like everything. But um, uh, yeah, just got my eyebrows done. I'm about to head to West Elm and PetSmart to like pick up some things and then I will talk to you guys soon. But my eyebrows look so good and they will uh they're dark right now like a little bit darker than you know like they normally would be they're gonna lighten up I'll talk to you guys in a little bit all right so girl today is thursday april 28th and um i didn't update you guys the other day because i was tired i really didn't do anything and then yesterday i had a meeting and then um um, I literally edited my video, my Spring Trends 2022. If you haven't seen it, definitely go watch. Helps your girl out a lot. And I appreciate it if you have already watched and commented, girl. Thank you. I really honestly haven't been feeling like doing like content because your girl hair is not done. I'm getting my hair done like pretty, pretty soon, but I haven't really been liking my hair. You see, I need a relaxer. I haven't had a relaxer in since like the end of December. So it's been about what four months now you can definitely see but like i just need a relaxer i didn't do anything to my hair today i just wanted to come on camera because your girl just got a package baby and guess what she just got her lovey's that diera just dropped i just love diera i've been loving her for literally a very 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 long time just like everything about her so whenever she dropped her eyewear brand when she came out with her brand i didn't even know what it was but i was like whatever it is your girl gonna buy a period so when she came out with her eyewear and i was looking at everything i was like yes ma'am yes ma'am i was so excited for her watched all of her youtube videos um story just up into her launch i was so excited and happy for her now but i will say this I will say this, okay? Uh, you know, Dierra, I know I'm in Charlotte, but I mean, I could have been invited. I could have been invited to the Atlanta uh, launch. <laughs> you know what I mean? It wasn't that but a little drive, like three hours, three three hours and 30 minutes, four hours or whatever the case may be, but I would've took that drive for you. I literally would've took that drive or flight for you. Invite me next time. When you do something, invite me. <laughs> but anyway. So this is how it looks. And then when you open it up, it says Lorve. This is how that look. I'm just so proud. All right, so these are what they look like. Packaging, you know I'm here for the packaging, but I already knew she was gonna come through with the packaging simply because like of who she is. Like she don't have step. And then I'm going to turn the camera back around and show you guys uh the shades that i got and this is what they come with let me turn the brightness down just a little bit so that's how it looks it comes into like this little eyeglass um protector case so love just like the details of everything you guys you guys know it's like simple but like for me details might mean a lot so the first pair so even when you open it up just in case you're like wondering turn the brightness back down so even when you open it up, Lorve here, and then there's your glasses in a eyeglass, like, I don't know what this is, like a little eyeglass pouch. All right, so I had to turn this way because if not, this would show my view. So anyway, this is what the glasses look like. As you can see, it has the logo right here, just L-E, which is Lorve. And then inside, it says Lorve. On this side, it just says main event. So this, so cute i can't like i know i'm looking real crusty right now but baby i promise you i promise you you know i'm gonna make this a look quality baby it's not even flimsy it's not flimsy quality this is cute <laughs> airport me please airport me please these 
new era and same thing has Lorve here on the side and then the name of the glasses right here which is new era and then it has the logo right here both sides and then this is how they look again wait till i get to fit my hair done all of that it's gonna be real cute but this is super cute and i'm so here for it and uh i'm so glad i was able to get my hands on these because baby i love i love okay i love but yes so i just kind of wanted to do a little unboxing with you guys like really quick on camera um of what i got i'm so happy for diara literally like i said i was watching her and i can just see excuse me i can literally just see how excited um and just how much time and like effort um she put into like her brand and just making sure that it was perfect um so i'm just so happy you know for her like i said been loving her and her whole vibe so i definitely wanted to support um i think this might be ending this vlog honestly so i'm sorry if i didn't really do much <laughs> in this vlog um but yeah just in case like i may pick up the camera tomorrow i don't think i'm doing anything but if i do pick up the camera tomorrow i'll i'll continue on but if not then thanks so much for watching i really appreciate you guys we're gonna get back on this vlog game okay i'm gonna try and do what i need to do when it comes to vlogging but anyway, I'll talk to you guys next vlog or I will talk to you tomorrow.